Hello and welcome back. And today I'm going to be doing another collection update since well, a lot has changed since the last one, like over a month ago. So, anyways, let's get started. Down here we have the Dino Escape, I mean, Dino Tracker shelf. This one did change a bit. I mean, I just slid all of the stuff over, condensed it a little more, so I have some room for Epic Evolution stuff, which I'll get into. Saxo, same stuff. Truck, Rex, Trike, Sinos, Indominus. Anyways, here's some of the new stuff. That back evolution thing. Which, review coming soon. I don't know if this is going to get posted before the review or not. But, Epic Evolution Greg Sutures, which is nice. And then, this is going to be Epic Evolution. And then, as I get more... So probably a few of these are gonna have to go somewhere else. But yeah, but since because buying that line and BOTM, I haven't really been able to get much Epic Evolution yet. But now we got the Gray Pursuits, this Epic Evolution color changing captives Pyroraptor. Now moving on. This shelf hasn't really changed. I think this is a little different because I pulled like not too long ago, I pulled like Every single dinosaur off the shelf because I was playing some big game with like a cousin or whatever. So I don't think this is exactly the same, but I tried my best to do it. Then up here is the whatever it wants. Also, by the way, I'm gonna address. I'm sorry that but for some reason when recording videos on my phone, it's like just the square, not full video size. I don't know why, which is pretty annoying. That's not really what I want. So, um, I don't really like my series, but my tablet, the video quality is much worse. And my computer, for some reason, that messes up the audio. So, I guess I could do voiceovers, but I don't know. Anyways, hang on, I've kind of... This area, I don't know if I'm going to put the Imagine X stuff back. I might just keep them in a bank. I kind of like having them all in one place. But, I don't know. Anyways, I moved some of these captives here. And then we got some of the same things, but also Safari LTD. Utah Reyes I moved out here. Here are the two Triceratops. This is Tricer and Tiger from my series. Actually, this stuff is the same. Anyways, moving on. So anyways, the Dominion shelf changed a lot. So basically what I did is I moved this side of it. This is all stuff that appeared in the movie. This size is like the actual line, like, you know, live blurred on. You can try sort of like a raptor. Yeah, same stuff though. Morris, Allo, Dilo, Pyro, Harry, Rex, Dranatus, Quetzal. Though actually some of this stuff, I guess, before I only had this like out, I think. But, yeah, you got that raptor, you got... The ancient, the Rajasaurus that came with the helicopter set, Chromosaurus, Lyoplerid on the truck, <laughs> this Dominion captives, some Dominion minis. But I'm not too sure, but I think I think I should. I've gotten this since the last collection update. I don't know exactly why is this. These shelves haven't really changed too much. Actually, I guess I think this and this are new since last. So that's the same. This, I just don't really organize that much, so the Fallen Kingdom shelf is the same. The Lost World shelf ain't really different, though. I did put the Justin Bergy on this stain they just got. And then up on the BOTM shelf, and then also fossils and other things. Um, Still just the Gorgosaurus, though. Did change its pose. Um... I was watching a Bionicle source, like his review of the Utah Rainus, Walking with Dinosaurs, T Rex, and Change the Source. And I thought the idea, hey, you know what? I should buy some stains like that for more cool pose like this. Because I like the standing legs, it's a good idea, but I want to be able to have it stay like this. <laughs> or at least have standing legs, but then give it a posing rod. So, I bought some posing rods. Which I'm still assembling some and will be used for future video TM figures and, like I said before, I mean, showed before for a pterosaurs. But yeah, that's it for here. Moving on. And then, quick, lastly, 
this up on top of my dresser hasn't really changed. Same figures, just the Imaginex stuff. Still in these bins, is in this bin. I don't know. I, I would like having them all in one place, definitely. But still, I don't know, maybe at least Hammer. I'm going to have it on display because it's literally Hammer. Anyways, I think that's pretty much it for my collection this time. So actually, here's a quick look in the bin of extra dinosaurs. Just a bunch of captives eggs. Mattel car car. I really beat up Mattel car car. My King Collection Concavenator. Spare Heyman Collection Gallimimuses. These far LTD things. This is my only stuff. I don't know. I, I kind of want to put this guy out on the shelf, but I can't. I kind of like to have a few things in this bin. There's just something nostalgic and charming about having all your dinosaurs in a bin, so. I don't know. Anyways, that should be it right now. Anyways, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and I'm sure if you really like this video, I'm sure you'd like one of my other videos, like the first episode of my new series, so on. So, click right up here.